Oh, I'm sick with some kind of nasty flu, which leaves me really debilitated. As you all know, I'm sort of hyperactive, so the most I can do is lay here and video things. And I was looking around my bedchamber and realizing that there's actually quite a few things in this room that are strange if you're accustomed to a Western lifestyle, specifically American. So I thought I'd share them with you. So let's look around and see what we have. So up there, we have our air conditioner. It's actually built into the ceiling. This is really just the dispenser for the air conditioner. The actual air conditioning machine is outside, mounted outside our apartment. And what's nice about that is that there's no noise. So air conditioning units can be very, very loud. So this one's not at all. Actually, I really approve of this difference. Some other weird things though. The power outlets. So, let's see. Yeah. This is actually put in the middle of the walls all around this bedroom. The annoying thing about that is if you have a bed, no matter where you put the bed, it's blocking the outlets. Or the outlets are in the middle of your bed. I'm not certain that was really well thought out. The outlets should really be more towards the corners. Um, also different, of course, is the lighting. So you can't tell during the day because it's off right now, but that big light fixture is filled with hideous fluorescent light bulbs. So the lighting in our Korean apartment is rather garish and unappealing. But that is why we have these really lovely Hanji lamps. So the what looks like artificial flowers, those, that's actually a lamp and it's all made of paper. It's a traditional Korean paper technique. It's really quite nice actually. <clears throat> so another curious thing about our room is the balcony. And I use the word balcony loosely because in my opinion a balcony is something that should have direct outside access. Um, and this balcony doesn't. It actually has full glass sliding doors on the outside, which means it's mostly enclosed. And as far as I can tell, its whole function is to serve as a place where I can dry laundry. And you can tell this in the fact that mounted above it, oh, you can see there is a retractable extendable clothing rack and there's actually little fans mounted in the unit up there. Not certain how effective these fans are. Actually, I don't think they're very effective, but it's a nice idea, I suppose. Anyway, so those are the kind of some of the unique features of our bedroom. I think I'm gonna do a series of unique Korean apartment features for the rest of the apartment, but that would involve me actually bestirring myself and getting out of bed and frankly just sitting up right then to show you the laundry rack has pretty much drained me so now I think I need about an hour's worth of sleep to recover so uh, I hope you've enjoyed this completely improvised and utterly unprofessionally made film I'm gonna take a nap now have a nice day bye